hello everyone welcome to my channel once again and today in this video i will show you how you can deploy and host our team project atlas md in coe platform okay so before going into this video uh, there are two requirements of this deployment one is uh, you need a github account and second one is you need a coe account okay you can see uh, i will put both of these links in the description and i will also put the bot link in the description too so you have to go into the bot repo through that link uh, i am going by searching it in all github okay so here uh, this is my bot repo what you have to do is uh, click on this fork button okay here here click on this fork button uh, after clicking on this fork button what it will do it will create it it will create a copy of it and send into my github account okay so click on this create fork okay it will take uh, a couple of seconds to create a fork and it's done okay so now what you have to do is scroll down and click on this deploy to web button just click on it now, now uh, do not change this image link okay this is docker link okay now in the name uh, in name you can put uh, anything okay. now scroll down and uh, in the in the prefix section you can put slash or hash or anything you like but do not put at the rate at the rate is not recommended okay i am using minus so in the case of mongodb the issue of Quave is uh, it put automatically puts a space here. So what you have to do is just remove the space and put a plus here. Okay. So here you can see that I remove the space and put a plus inside it. So in the session ID, session ID is something tricky. Okay. Because uh, what you are entering in session, it will work as an OTP to get QR. So uh, in this board, you don't have to scan any QR before okay you have to scan after deploying so in session id just put uh, anything i am putting phantox uh, something complex because it will work as an otp and don't forget to keep it copied and in mongodb you can use your own mongodb url also okay that will be more secure now in the mod section uh, let me uh, here i have already added mods to show you how you can add multiple mods by using a comma and don't uh, put any plus uh, sorry don't put any plus or any space okay don't put anything uh, let me show you once again uh, in 91 here 91 is my country code uh, this is my number and that's how you can add and to add multiple numbers as simple as that so in tenor api key i have already provided you can use your own if you have any now in the pack name pack name and keep it as default because these two are not effective these two are not necessary and you don't have to change anything just scroll down and click on this deploy button here in the below just click on the deploy button and now you can see that deployment is queued and deployment has been started so if you have used Quave before, you might know that Quave is very slow and it will take around uh, 4 to 5 minutes to totally deploy the app. So we have to wait around, um, we have to wait almost more than 4 minutes to get started. Okay, so I am fast forwarding the video and here you can see that there is less than 1 minute ago written. So I will come back when there will be written 4 minutes. So 4 minutes have passed, so now I have to just refresh this page. After refreshing, go into runtime logs and see if it's working or not. Okay, so it is giving QR, so that means it is working. So now go to service and here you can see that there is the domain link, just click on it. And it will redirect you to the web page of the port. Now just paste the session that you set while deploying and click on the get QR. But before clicking on the get QR, uh, let me come into my phone screen. At first, open WhatsApp, go into three dots, go to link device, go to link a device, and 
now click on the get QR and scan the QR through WhatsApp now you can see it's logging me in and it's logged me in and if I go into my web and runtime logs so you can see what is receiving messages and started working so let me test it for you that whether it is working or not so I have set the prefer prefix as minus so let's test and as you know that Quave is very slow the platform is already slow so what will also work slow so let's wait until it's reply okay so what has started working in Quave uh, let's test let's test some comments this is the ffmpg related command let's test okay so i am downloading the audio let's see if it's work working or not okay so ffmpg working fine so let me test more if i base boost it what happens okay so bot is totally working and if i download the video let's test that too okay so video is also coming uh, now let me test sticker comments also if i use minus s or minus sticker okay so you can see that it is working fine you can change bot character by this following command and to get character list let me show you this is the character list of bot here you can see uh, the footer is Marin Kitagawa and if you change it to something like uh, Chika and click on the send and let's see what happens so here you can see bot character has been changed to Chika MD and if I type minus h or minus help so let's see what happens okay so here you can see that bot character has been changed to chika md and also bot's video has also changed into chika md okay you can add your own character also here here is the source code of the bot this bot has 300 plus uh, commands and 100 plus nsfw feature so I am not showing NSFW because this is not according to YouTube's guidelines. So you can also make logos. The logo making also working. So there is also economy commerce too. Let's check. So economy also working. So let's check the mod list. So here is the mod list. You can add mods by simply, uh, for example, uh, just select anyone and type add mod. And send. And you can see that uh, that Atlas end is added to mod successfully. Now, if I check the mods, you can see that Atlas end in the last is added as mod. Okay, so you can give admin privilege to anyone and also revoke the admin privilege. Select someone and type Dell mod, and that person will be removed from moderation. So you can explore more features of the bot yourself. And that's all about the video, guys. 
सो आई होप यू विल लाइक आवर टीम प्रोजेक्ट एंड इफ यू रियली लाइक आवर प्रोजेक्ट प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड फॉलो आवर डेवलपर्स इन द गिटअप एंड देट्स हाउ यू कैन मोटिवेट अस थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग दि भिडियो टिल दि एंड थैंक यू